Greetings, Benjamin J from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, look what has just arrived. A Lionel General. I found this on eBay for 40 bucks, and uh, it had been on uh, eBay for quite a while. It's a straight DC locomotive, so nobody wanted it. In any case, 40 bucks, I bought it, and uh, going to build a rectifier for it so I can run it on standard track voltage. But I went through my parts, and I am out of diodes. So in the meantime, I'm going to run it on DC. The problem is, of course, where do you find a variable output DC transformer? Well, the easy way to do it is like this. This is a uh, old Radio Shack 12 volt DC transformer. This is what I use for, for running that electric whistle. And uh, I've just connected it to a magnetic lock on, as you see, and then plugged the transformer into a standard lamp dimmer. So you vary the input voltage to the transformer, that varies the output voltage to the track, as you see. And it gives you full range of voltage from zero to a full 12 volts, as you see. So more than good enough to run this until I build the rectifier. It's simple, it's straightforward, it's easy. Already had the lamp dimmer, already had the transformer. So it's a really simple way to vary the output of a 12 volt transformer just by varying its input. As you see, this works really, really well. And you have infinite amount of uh, variance on the output. So you can run it as slow as you want, as fast as you want, up to 12 volts DC anyway. So this works, it actually works quite well. So you have uh, a full variable output DC transformer that costs you virtually nothing. This is just an old Radio Shack transformer. I use it for experiments. Like I said, I've been using it to run that electric whistle. And just plug it into a lamp dimmer. Lamp dimmers are 10 bucks. You get them at Lowe's, Menards, Home Depot, anywhere. And you plug the transformer into the uh, lamp dimmer and the lamp dimmer plugs into the wall. And then you have basically a thumb operated rheostat to vary the voltage going to the transformer. And of course, that varies the voltage coming from the transformer. It works absolutely perfectly. So I'll order some more diodes. In the meantime, if I want to run this, I'll just go ahead and run it on DC for now. It works, it's simple. It was really cheap, 40 bucks, hard to beat that. The uh, locomotive itself looks virtually new. The only thing missing is the headlight, which I should be able to replace reasonably easily so anyway I just want to do a quick video on a, a simple way to make a variable DC transformer so good enough for now and uh, be running this and I'll order some more diodes and when the diodes get here I'll build a rectifier and just uh, solder it directly to the motor it'll run on standard AC track voltage that way so I just want to do a quick video as always if you have any questions feel free to drop me an email benstrains at gmail.com and as always Thank you for watching.